Hello lovely people, welcome back to Melda's Kitchen. Let's fry some fish. Stay with me. I'll be right back. So yes, as I said, we are making some fried fish today. So I'm using croaker and pompono fish. You can use any fish of your choice. So it's not cleaned proper. I asked the butcher to clean for me, but it's not really cleaned. So I'm going to clean it again. But before then, I will soak it in water for a while. So I added my vinegar here. Yeah? Then I'll add in a little bit salt as well. Then I'm going to add in my lemon juice. If you have them, you can just cut it and squeeze it. Squeeze the juice in. But since I have this already, I'm going to add a little bit. Allow it to be in the water for about 10 minutes. Then I will clean it proper. So after that, I will divide it as I prefer. So feel free to divide yours any size you prefer. Once again, a very warm aquaba to you if today is your first time. Please don't forget to subscribe and also turn on your notification bell. My name is Emelda. I will be so happy if you join this amazing and wonderful family. So now I'm using my fish season. Yeah, I'll use one such it, then I'll use about one and a half teaspoon of my homemade season, then I'll use one teaspoon salt as well then after that i will shake it as you can see me doing if you are not good in the shaking part <laughs> just use your wooden spoon or any spoon to mix it very gently as you can see me doing yeah because we want the season to go on the fish very well I'll cover it and allow it to stay there for about 10 minutes before I will start frying. So I'm using this fish buttered mix here. If you don't have it, you can just use um, flour, normal flour. Yeah. So I will add in some black pepper crush a little bit. Then I will mix it together. So now I will dip it in my, I will dip the fish in the flour as you can see me doing. Then I'll put it on my plate aside. So after that, I will just cut some onions, put it in my oil and I added a little bay leaf as well. I want the flavor to infuse my oil then it will make my fish taste so good. So yeah. I let I just put all the fish in the oil as you can see. Then I'll use my fork to turn it over or flip it over so that the other side will cook as well. So after putting it in the oil, I left it for about two minutes before turning it over. Yeah. Now it's ready. About four to five minutes in the oil, it is ready. If you want it very hot, you can leave it more. But remember that you low your cooker, or else your fish will get burnt. Yeah. Once again, a very warm aquaba to you. Please don't forget to subscribe and hit on the notification bell so that each time I post, you'll be first to know also share this video and if you like what i'm doing don't forget to give me a thumb up my name is emelda thank you so much for being with me today and also to my subscribers thank you all so much god really bless you for always coming back to see watch me god really bless you so look our fish is ready it is so good and it is so nice thank you once again for being with me today god really bless you i will see you in my next video bye, -bye.